How's it going guys? Welcome back. Alice is dead. Chapter 2. Based on the Newgrounds medals, I apparently did play this game. It was just back in 2010, so I don't remember any of the puzzles or the plot or anything. And completely unconfirmed if I ever played the third one. I don't actually know, but I'm excited to get back into it. Huge syringe, uh, big old gun and everything. The rabbit's a bit of a badass. He dual wields. We're a badass. We're the rabbit. <laughs> I remembered who I was and what I had done. He looks a lot more hardcore there than he did in the mirror. It was just one last job. Just one last kill. The white rabbit had trained assassin and it all went wrong. Had to escape. But she was already there. Is she wielding a big rifle? Alice is dead. Oh, turning that into the A is so clever and so awesome. I love it. <laughs> as quick as the memories came back, they were gone. You just got clubbed and knocked right out again? Instant amnesia all over a second time around? That's terrible, terrible luck, isn't it? Oh man, the art, the like frame and UI for this game is really cool as well. Tickets are probably already sold out. Nice, sharp piece of glass. Tickets to, to all these apparently are sold out. Toilet still works. Good, good to know, just in case I uh, have a need to go. Oh, just what I needed, a bell. Which, that's really interesting. We found the bell in the last game. Either I didn't know how or where to use it, or it literally never was relevant. But, like, we were knocked out, woke up in this room, and we still have the bell, which, you know, makes sense. The door is locked. Hey, Hattie, my boy. Okay, that's awesome that this game actually has voice acting, too. There's so many good voice actors on Newgrounds. I'm pretty sure I saw that Tom Mado, Joshua Tomar, was involved with this project. So, like, there's a good chance this is him. What if it isn't the Rebbe? Come to see his old pal, the Atta. Well, is there, is there anything you want to talk about? Or anything you want to, to help me with? Do I know you? I have the card in me. <laughs> it's been a rough couple days, okay? Oh, reply. I read it as replay at first. That's why I didn't immediately click it. I guess I do. Mind telling me where we are? We're in jail. Seems pretty modern. <laughs> jail for what? Fantastic. Dare I ask why? I love the reinterpretation of the Mad Hatter as this, like, psychotic old gangster. Well, I'm gonna get out of here. I've had enough of you. I'm out of this place. Alright, I'm gonna go check things out fine, but I hope it's the last time I see you. I'm so not used to this having voice acting that I'm... I'm speaking over things as I'm clicking the reply. I gotta give it some space there so I don't overlap like that. Oh god, what is this fungus-riddled merman? Your cellmate seemed like a nice, uh, whatever he was. It's not even a fish body, it's an octopus body, which is messed up. I don't think you'll be able to make it to the show. Might as well redecorate while you're here. My finger is on the button. The message seems quite cryptic and complicated. Well, I assume it means his finger, perhaps. It looked like his finger was up to something. Ah, this could come in handy, I hope. Oh, not the type of button I was thinking. Lewis, stop! Which is that, Carol Lewis? Is that the author of Alice in Wonderland? That's what that's about? Seems the staff isn't too happy with Lewis. You probably need this. Great, just a picture of a key. Oh, is this his body? There's a key inside of him? Someone ate something shiny. 
Well, I'm going to assume you got to slice him open. Uh, yeah, that's <laughs> the only other thing I think I could do here. The glass is too sharp to hold in your bare hand. That makes <laughs> sense. <laughs> if it's sharp enough to, to rip someone open and, you know, fiddle around in their insides, that means it's probably too sharp to just go grabbing it up. Do you know anything about this bell? Oh, great. The one thing they didn't take from me. Yeah, it still rings. Button, know anything? There's, it's a little bit of a Mark Hamill's Joker quality, but if you made him a little bit more thuggish. I kind of, I like it. I dig what they were doing here. The dead guy in my cell has a key. Oh, Lewis. Lewis has a key. You need to get the key out of Lewis. Well, then you'll probably need to find the magic or not. Seems like you maybe made that up. P pardon? Sometimes you. Seems like everyone here is maybe at least a little bit nuts. Can you please be more clear? Just explain what the damn nut it'll does. You. That's what it'll do, but only for a few moments. So you must work quickly. And then? Do I have to crawl around in this guy? You need to find the magical nut still. Yeah, I'm not quite ready, I guess. I'll get on that. Well, I found one nut, you, but I'll try to find another. Nice seeing you too, Revy. Which or where <laughs> do we think we could find a nut? It's not a big cell. How does he know a nut exists? If you know that there's a nut at all, hook me up, man. Here's one place I didn't go rooting around or, or looking. Flush and grab the nut quickly. Okay, you have like a, a tiny amount of time. Why would you ever? <laughs> I don't think I just want to shrink like myself and cut the guy open. I don't, like, I don't see how that would help. Do I give him the nut? L Lius doesn't seem very hungry. Small little, little typo. I could cut the nut open. Now nah, I, I, st I still would have to hold the glass for that. All right, I found the nut man. What's the next step? What if it isn't the Rebbe? You need to find the magical nut still. Untrue. I found it. I found your damn stink nut. Good, now just cut open, Lewis, and whisper your darkest secret into the nut. Oh, no. The, what? Who is that reminding me of? At for, for a second, I thought David Tennant... There's, like, something I watched recently. Like, there's a little bit of Mark Hamill's Joker in there, but he sounds so much like someone. Oh, it's going to drive me nuts. I hope... Uh, drive me nuts. I hope someone <laughs> in the comments is similarly picking up on something. Together, we got to figure out who the heck this sounds like. Anyways. Cut him open. There's no other way. Are you mad? Oh, right. You're going to probably want to cut him where the key is so you don't have to dribble down his throat or up his... Look, you'll probably just want to cut him open. That's horrible. Well, then, I better get started. I hope this works so I don't have to see you again. Nice seeing you too, Revy. Oh, is it a little bit Andy Circus? Ah, there's, it reminds me of a lot of things. Maybe that's what it is. Maybe it's like one of those voices. What could I be holding it with? Give me give me your cloth or whatever. Rip, rip off whatever that little thing is around him there. And I could I could hold it using that instead. What, what else? Rip a poster off the wall or something? Use the, the bedspread? I'm not tired. Ah, there we go. We got to strip a cloth. I, I should have, it should have occurred to me sooner that, like, I probably had to go looking for something like that. Okay, now I'm a butcher. Yeah, he seemed like a nice, uh, whatever he was. In we go. You whisper your darkest secret to the nut. Which, what would that have been, do you think? Gross little maggot organs, slimy, shiny organs. Oh, you poke the stomach. <laughs> stab that open. You stab the stomach. 
but it's too hard here. Really, though, would this have shrunk down with me? I don't know, our clothes shrunk. We'll try not to think too much on that. I'm just, I'm, I'm, I'm just trying to stab whatever, man. There's not that many different options of places to stab. It says it's too hard, like, everywhere. What, is, what about these little maggots and things? I can't, I can't go down further into the stomach like I thought would maybe be the case. Oh, this part seems soft. Okay, so you just gotta click around until you find the, the soft part. So right around here, and we go. Oh, what? why does it have eyes? Oh God, Ugh. a giant worm is blocking you. Well, kill that, why does it have eyes in its mouth? Gross, you stab the beast in its soft head. Oh, it looks like an earthworm. What are we hearing? Who's talking? Is there someone in the cell now? The key is stuck. It won't budge. Plan B? There's some sort of struggle going on out there. Is someone wrestling the hatter or something? Where is that music coming from? Great. The magic nut is wearing off. Oh, but at this point, we should be able to just, like, reach our hand in there, right? I couldn't get the key. Now what? I think you just fiddle around in his inside, insides, dude. It's gross, but... You put me in a bad mood. The Hatter's gone, but he left you a message. Me? Uh, we were pals. You know, nice seeing you, that whole thing. You seem like a nice whatever. Where is the music coming from? That is a genuinely good question, yes. Oh! At least the Hatter left the door open. Scanning outside is like a television screen? Strange hole in the wall? Oh, oh, okay, I can control that. And oh my god, what is... Creeping out in the distance there. Now there's a phone ringing? There's so much going on. Oh god. The Hatter definitely... I thought someone was attacking the Hatter. I think the Hatter was attacking everyone else. Should have taken the stairs. <laughs> taken, took in, taked the stairs. The door to the Hatter's cell, it's locked. How did he get out, like, through my cell? That doesn't even make sense. I don't understand at all. I'm, I'm sorry, dude. I don't think I want to take the elevator. Not going in there. No, no, nothing, nothing in there. Nothing valuable you want to claim. Oh, man. Yes, you can always take more than nothing. And not a crumb. Implausible dancing, irrefutably accentuating chuckles from Hattie. I call him Hattie just kind of like joking around. Apparently he calls himself Hattie. Idiac. Let's try to see if, like, the first letter was a thing. The Wonderland something safety penalty charge notice. Probably not. I don't, probably don't have to read all that. The Hatter's Code broken. Queen elected for third term in office. Yeah, there was rigged elections. Pictures. The Queen's outstanding new dress. What the heck? Over the past six years, over 42 people on the Heartland Council of Civics and Rights have gone missing or died in freak accidents. Some reports indicate these murders to be kind of weird, but no one has been charged with the task of finding out what the heck is going on. Is that us? Is the rabbit killing everyone? Funny skull found. Very silly. Funny looking skull, possibly belonging to a walrus man. But we're not sure. It's damned weird though. Tired of eating, I think is what's cut off at the bottom there that we can't quite see. The Mad Hatter strikes again. Uh, it's pretty tough to see what's at the beginning there, or at the, at the top. Charlotte never saw. May 23rd, 43, 2043. Diagram is not the way to be... Ever since the Hatter has dropped off the political radar, he's popped up on the police one. The once respected political tool of the Queen herself has gone haywire and is on the loose. Four dead in downtown Hedge after a waitress dropped his order of 
oiled Spanish moss and chips. He went insane and stabbed her and three other customers to death with one of those little plastic sandwich swords, says James Jamerson of James Family Rookeries. He was eating, continued on page two, cure in sight for possible and no one has ever, it will certainly be, this reporter is happy if we ever go Harper DA. Hatter's code broken, the main story here. The Hatter's mysterious notes may actually have clues hidden in them. Ever since the terrible mysterious accident that seems to have permanently rendered our loving hat maker insane, he's been leaving cryptic notes at the scenes of his heinous crimes. Which a lot of Hatters went insane due to mercury poisoning, which I think was like a, a, re like a way they dyed their hats or something. I forget what the mercury was for. It's, and I think that's why in some versions the Hatter has like orange hair and stuff and pale skin. All that is like mercury poisoning. The loyal and noble heart police are said to be on his trail now that they have cracked his secret code. In every note he's left, the second letter seemed to be key. I looked at the first letter. And perhaps shows that this madman isn't as mad as everyone thinks. It's terrible what has happened to my good friend. He and I go way back, and I hope that one day we'll catch him, and we can get him the help he needs. The queen, the queen herself. Do I need to worry about this note? Probably the actual note is the one. What has the Hatter done? At least I don't have to sneak around. M-A-R-C-H March. Yes? But where that applies, or what to do with it, I have no idea. Hmm, more rooms. There's dead Alice in the corner. How long have they been watching me? I don't... That might also be from the first game. This is all sorts of, all sorts of things going on. The safe is locked. And Dr. Raymond Burr. Dr. Raymond Burr was a cowardly man with a big heart. Until he lost all his money. Cowardly man with a big heart until he lost all his money. Cowardly man with a big heart until he lost all his money. So I need to make him into a chicken, a big heart, which it seems to be randomizing when I click, until he lost all his money, probably like two open hands, based on the one open hand I saw. Oh, throwing the coin away. That's gotta be the one. the hell was that arm? Oh, hello, Monsters Inc. door. You need to find the evidence before you leave. The evidence of what the Hatter did? The button does not open the safe. Dang, that would have been so easy for me. <laughs> oh, I can't type here, can I? What? Hello? Command not recognized, help, type help for supported commands. Look up, logs, unlock. So look up. Look up. Aw, oh, come on. <laughs> logs? Log 202, announcing casual Friday. Plumbing problems, Lewis is eating. Casual Friday canceled. Urgent, rabbit. Hatter is out of... Crimson status, hello boys. Oh, can I do like 202 or log 202? To like access specific logs or anything like that? So it seems like that would be a thing. Hello? <laughs> hmm. Alright, then not logs. What was the last? Unlock. Unlock was the last one. March is the password. Yes, right? Probably. Unlock. March. Unlock March. Dang it. Oh, unlock March? Safe opened. Haha, <laughs> there we go. Cracking the code. I feel like a, a genuine hacker. <laughs> you found the evidence. Oh, evidence against us? You can look at the evidence later. Getting ahead of ourselves here. Oh, I gotta redo this then. Out we go. Yeah, it just takes you straight to the overworld. Not a clue how that door works. 
You pushed the button. Maybe you shouldn't have. Error. Hey, fishies. What the hell did I just do? Something fishy, apparently. I had more questions than answers. But one thing was clear. Wait, did I kill Alice because of me? Alice is dead. <laughs> the mystery grows and deepens. Heck yeah. I really do like Hyptosis' art, just in general, but especially how they, they applied it in this game here. Well, hopefully we can kind of understand a little bit more of what was going on here in the third game. Tamamoto, Joshua Tomark, fantastic voice actor, has contributed to like a hundred things on Newgrounds, if not more. Music by Hania. I also love Hania. That's awesome. She has fantastic music, and her band Tracker is also cool. What in the sweet hell? That's this version of the Cheshire Cat? Oh, it's the most disgusting, horrible thing I've ever seen. Why is it like an insect monster? Ah! Oh. That's so disturbing. I should have assumed that some random thing in the distance that appears and disappears would be the Cheshire Cat. That makes sense. Oh man, this series is cool. Alright, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you again with Alice is Dead, Chapter, Episode 3. They're changing the naming conventions on us. Soon. <laughs>